Hi, I'm Jay Haynes for the Film Sensei YouTube channel. Today in this video, we are going to do this steel metallic like 3D beveled text in HitFilm Pro. So today I am working in 7 version of HitFilm Pro. And this new version has a new 3D extrusion and beveled text feature. So I'm going to create a new composite shot and click OK. I'm going to add in a new text layer. And it doesn't matter what it looks like. Uh, it just needs to, you know, essentially be text, right? Uh, because then you will work with that as we go, right? So if I were to just real quickly... Just sort of create this uh, and maybe just do that. Okay, so now I have this text, right, that I have applied here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to twirl it open, and under geometry, I'm going to add the bevel effect. Okay, now you say, well, I don't see any difference. That's because it's not lit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a new light. It's going to want to add a camera, and I say, yes, I do. And there is the text right there. And if you can see that as I move this around, it interacts with that light, right? If I take this light and just bring it forward a little bit, then it shows that, and you can change the beveling of that. You can change, so for example, you can change the extrusion. Here's the expansion of the bevel itself, right? Here is the expansion of the extrusion. I think I'm just going to leave those basically where they were, though, for, for this demonstration of it. But you can sort of see how that already has a sort of metallic look to it, okay? But if I were to grab this and bring it in and I go ahead and make it uh, invisible, mute it as it were, uh, but I add a parallax effect to this and I drop it on the text itself and if I twirl it open and just sort of source that uh, steel picture. And by the way, I get the steel picture from my friend Eric Matias. I'll leave a, a link in the description below to his website, soundimage.org. But I'm basically just stealing the texture from this picture of steel here. And you can see, even without messing around or changing uh, that right away, that looks pretty good. Now, I probably would want to adjust. Uh, the parallax on that, I might invert that and maybe take it down just a little bit. Um, you know, but when I move that around right away, you can see that there is a fairly interactive light uh, and, and situation with that. And that that looks pretty cool, right? So it's very quick and easy to create uh, a steel looking text in HitFilm. So then the question becomes, can I do this, or at least something similar to this, in HitFilm Express? And the answer is, I think so. Take a look at this. So the next video, I will be doing the same thing, but in HitFilm Express. So if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Otherwise, thanks for watching.